welcome to Crafty K. Today I'm going to be sharing with you how to make this beautiful frame with gems on the sides and flowers on the corners. Hope you like it. This frame can be used to make put pictures and make pictures like that where you put your the frame up like that and you put your heads through or you can use it to um like to put pictures in but we took out the glass for because we wanted to do it to put pictures in i mean sorry for the misunderstanding i meant to say to put your heads through and take beautiful pictures the things that you will need for this craft are some flowers. Gems are optional, but they make it look more glamorous. And we're using the fake flowers, of course. And a frame. You, we decided to use card. Um, we decided to use the, a frame, not cardboard, because it makes it more simple and it just. I just think it looks better. But you're still allowed to um, take a box of cardboard, or any type of cardboard, and cut it to make a rectangle or a square, uh, and make the same thing, just like this. Okay, so this is how you start off to make this craft. You, f you take your frame, and you take, you, if you want to make um, uh, one for your pick to take pictures with, then you take off the glass. But if you don't want to, you it's better if you cover the glass up with some newspaper. Oh, and one other um material that you will need is hot glue to glue the things together. After you're done taking out the glass or putting newspaper on top. Then you can start by arranging your flowers on, not gluing it yet. I recommend you first place them on to see how it looks and if you like it. And after you're done, you hot glue them on. And what I did is I, just to make it look a little bit more better, is I took some of these um, gems and stuck them on some a few of the petals in random order, just to make it look more pretty. After I, I finished arranging and gluing on my flowers, I started taking my leaves and gluing them on in random places just to make it look more glamorous. And last but not least, this is optional but it looks very pretty. You can make it, you can add these gems on the corners just to make it look more pretty. And if you want, you don't have to have this or I, I just took the gold and then put it on the outer edges on both sides and then the silver in the um, inner edges of it. But you can do it like in a pattern. It can be as different as you want from mine. It doesn't have to look the same. So after you're done this, um, then you're done. So that's how you that's how you make it. And when I made this craft, I got a lot of compliments on it and one of my friends asked me to make one for her birthday. So if you want me to share how I make it um and step by step, I'm totally fine to make a video on that. Be sure to tell me in the comments down below. One thing I just wanted to help you with is just where I got these materials from. These gems I got from Dollar Store for a cheap price. Same with the flowers. The flowers came with the leaves and the stems. So you just make be sure to pluck off the leaves and um, flowers and to stick them on and that will help you or is it gonna have to or you can just cut them off but they were very easy for me to pluck them off so I just pluck them off you're done okay so remember please remember to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you'll get the notification every time I post a new video and just telling you I 
I made this for Diwali. So that doesn't mean you have to use the same things I use. You can change up the colors, the flowers, you can add birds. It doesn't matter. You have to change it up for whatever occasion you want. Okay, bye!